And then this compression will be like, uh, the compression will go. <laughs> Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Lee Wai Ping. I'm a senior consultant, breast surgeon at Solis. Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Lim Siu Khan. I'm also a senior consultant at Solis Breast Care. Okay, so today we are going to find out what is the internet most searched breast health questions. Get ready to hear from us. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so what are the questions today? Okay, First see. question. Okay, what is a mammogram and how is it done? Okay, so a mammogram is simply just an x-ray of the breast. So what happens is that the breast is placed between two plastic plates and compression will be applied for a few seconds. This will be done on one breast at a time. So this is how a mammogram is done. Okay, second question. Oh, benefits of a 3D mammogram compared to a 2D mammogram. So as we all know, 3D mammogram is something that's very new. Um, it involves the uh, multiple images taken from the breast at various angles, giving rise to a 3D appearance compared to what it is, the standard conventional 2D mammogram. So what are the benefits? Okay, so a 3D mammogram allows us to look at the breast parenchyma in more detail and clarity. So it allows us to pick up smaller cancers uh, more accurately, especially those what, well, which are less than 2 cm in diameter. It also decreases the recall rates of the mammograms, meaning that patients don't get called back for extra mammogram views so often. So the third question, what does an abnormal mammogram result mean? Well, most people will think that an abnormal result equates cancer. But fortunately, it doesn't. It just means that something abnormal, okay, something that's not normal or previously not seen has been picked up on the latest x-ray. So this also means that uh, a breast specialist uh, visit is definitely warranted. We need to actually find out and exclude an early cancers in such situations. Okay, fourth question. What happens after an abnormal mammogram result? Okay, I know, I know. See us. <laughs> See us, then do what? Let's see. Okay, so we need a good clinical assessment first. Okay. And then, and then we will do further imaging. If it's a normal, yes. what do you need to do? Well, we will have to do further imaging studies. Sometimes we may have to complement with an ultrasound scan. And if that is still abnormal, biopsy. Okay, so be sure to make breast health your first priority at every age. Breast awareness and annual mammogram screening can detect cancers at its most treatable stage. Thank you for watching us today. Bye-bye.